and I'm going to get to drive here. Welcome back to 007 Legends. So, um, yeah, controls are pretty much as I expected, so this should be interesting. And as you go, I'm actually going to get to drive. Okay. Oh god, and I'm getting shot at and crashing in already. Um, so, yeah, this is exactly where I thought the second license to kill mission would be on this area where I like to in that lorry. It was a nice little cut. Oh god. Yeah, thank you. Needed that to tell me I was going the wrong way. And yeah, actually getting to drive a vehicle now. Um, didn't think that was happening. My like, god, I am. This one, but there's no way to shoot myself because obviously Bond's driving. I, I actually wondered whether this bit would be like um, driving and me with the gun in the passenger seat. But I'm guessing I'm just meant to be dodging them, but I'm not doing too good with that. Um, I ran a yeah, around that, even though he wasn't actually in the car. Uh, so yeah, I'm pursuing Sanchez, who um, I wonder if I'm going to kill him with a lighter uh, while he's coming in and stuff. But I got to a checkpoint. Oh god. <laughs> the car just bounces back, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'm trusting that this road's just going in the right direction. But yeah, the driving mechanic here is very, very basic, just what you'd expect. There's no drifting, it's not very up, that's for sure. That'd be cool if Bond was just like throwing Cooper shells at the bad guys. Just need a blue shell and that'll take out Sanchez right there and then. God, how would that do? Oh, that's what I want to have an inspector now. The new Bond helmet. It'll end with a car chase, chasing the villain. Bond just unleashes a blue spiny shell and that kills the villain. That'd be pretty cool. Wow. This might be a very short mission. Who's that? Oh god, we've got the controls. Because I was holding the um, trigger to... Um... Oh god. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Because I was holding the trigger to accelerate. I was just pressing the trigger to shoot them when it's actually the shoulder button. Oh, helicopter. Oh, no. Whoa. Can you reach? Hello Sanchez. Oh god! Nice. Oh well, I'm gonna repeatedly press that. Kick me, quick me, grab it back on them. Oh, I got it. Oh, did I stab him? Whoa, is that it? Oh no, checkpoint, so there's something else coming. Or is it now the punch up? I wonder. Where are you, Sanchez? This is a very, very short mission. When I'm through with you, I'm going to find your friend Pam. Fight, you big! Oh god! I wish I had my gun still, be like Indiana Jones then. Whoa! Okay, this is more like punch out. Oh god. Set with knives. Stab out. Is what this is. Quickly disarm him! And you can do the punching thing. Here we go. Right, here we go. Yeah, just every boss fight's gonna be this. I have every mission had one of these. Belfin had the guard. Second one was the odd job. I managed to serve it. No, there wasn't one in the first mission on Magic Secret Service. That was a skiing thing. So they failed. So I'm guessing on Moonraker we'll have Jaws and Hugo Drax. No. All this for my friend. Felix Leiter. <laughs> that was a joke from. Um, live and let die. Uh, and yeah, I completed that 100% there. Completion time 50 minutes and 12 seconds. I did that shorter than that. Yeah, and a trophy. So I'm going to start up the next mission and show the
cutscene for the beginning of next section because this is only six minutes so far. So we'll start by another day in this section because that was a very very short mission that. NSA agent Giacinta Johnson checked into the ice hotel 45 minutes ago. She's waiting to brief you on the mission in the ice bar. You'll need to find her. Lucian, I'm telling you, it's not our fault. Ladies and gentlemen, dangerous demonstration. So this is Die Another Day. They cut out the end of License to Kill showing Felix I could have been extremely happy even though he's lost his wife and his leg. Okay. So, let's do Die Another Day. Who am I talking to here, I wonder? Bond? James Bond? You must be Jacintia Johnson. My friends call me Jinx. That's Halle Berry, apparently. Unlucky in love. Doesn't really look much like her. What have you learned about Graves and the Icarus? We have to sneak into Graves' office before the demonstration. I'll bring you up to speed on the way. Right, okay, um, I'm actually going to end the part here and then start by another day properly. I think that's Graves, over there. Cool, um, I'm gonna keep talking. Right. Uh, gonna pause it there. Uh, what I've got to do, confirm his identity and something about free arms dealers, photograph them. Okay, well, I'm gonna end the part here. Very, very short part, but very, very short mission.